you're going to need a plump cushion and you're going to line it up right by the pubic bone with your knees just slightly bent kind of locking it underneath knees about shoulder width apart the key to the wall kiss is to take the chest bone and lift it up towards the wall you're going to be kissing the wall with the chest bone and it's a lengthening of the spine so take a look at that I'm lifting my chest up toward the wall it comes up I kiss the wall with my chest now notice my shoulder is in front of the hips and this is what we want to do we want to encourage the body to go into the corrected position so we start with an over correction obviously we're not going to walk around leaning forward like this but this is how we make the correction once in that position you tuck your chin in so your ears are back in alignment with your shoulder and then you tuck your tailbone under so you've corrected these three problems here let's look at that again kiss the wall with your chest it's a lengthening lift straight up through the chest tuck the chin in tuck the tailbone right under taking out that extra lordosis watch again I'm just demonstrating how far back somebody's shoulders may be from the hips there's the wall kiss tucking the chin right in bringing your ears back in line with the shoulders and tucking the tailbone under to slightly flatten that big curve that we see in posture type A this is not a leaning a bending so you're not going to want to do what I've just shown you there that's the incorrect way it's a definite lift and lengthening so there it is that last bit nice posture there and now I'm going to look at this freestanding I've put myself into this <laughs> terrible looking posture once again but this is amazing you'll see this a lot even though this looks fairly extreme big sway back sticky out chin maybe a bit of a fatty neck lump there and a definitely leaning back posture you can see this in pregnancy a lot of women but men also so watch how we do it freestanding lifting the chest tucking the chin tucking the tailbone under you'll hold this for 10 seconds when you're doing them and repeat 10 times in a row lift from the chest the chest goes higher tuck the chin and get rid of that lumbar lordosis by tucking the tailbone under hold for 10 and one more time and you do 10 times in a row even when you're doing them against the wall